My name is Manraj. I'm a senior at Yelan Years College. My name is Zhiyang. Uh, I'm a freshman. Hello, my name is Jay. I am a senior in environmental studies and this is urban agriculture. I am uh, assistant professor Marvin Montefrio and I am in the environmental studies program and I te I'm teaching this course called Urban Agriculture and it has uh, a significant experiential component meaning that the students are expected to grow their own food. Half the class is a theory-based or a discussion-based class where we talk about certain concepts or readings that we had and the other half of the class is really managing our own plot. So you can see here is my Malabar spinach. Well, I'm working on the Arrow Spring, which is a hydroponic system and other students have been working on uh, actual soil plant beds. So these are the small uh, tomato plants that we grew uh, right from the seeds and we created like a small mini trellis for them because they are climbers, right? And then they need some support to grow. I think this offered a real hands-on experience. We actually observed the process of uh, growing our own plants. In many ways, we are a very academic institution. You know, we're, we're a liberal arts institution. You know, we have brilliant students who are able to handle really difficult um, academic texts. But I thought that, um, and many of us think that experiential learning um, contributes a lot to that, the theoretical learning as well. There's always a tendency that if we're, if we're focused a lot on the theory, for example, that the learning would all be based on what we read through the books. The textbook will provide you, for example, to the characteristics of a good soil, good soil chemistry, good soil microbiology. But, but to actually be able to see that, to touch that, and to be able to, to reap the benefits of the quality of that soil is an entirely different learning experience. It was just a very refreshing course. Like I never came to any of the classes feeling tired. There's a lot of help that comes and goes around. There's just a lot of support. I think we see that even in this class, which has been really nice. You know, in Yon US, most of our classes are like extremely intellectual, like very readings heavy and that's great. But I think there's just something very grounding about coming here and like dealing with the soil and watering my plants and making like checking out, making sure that everything's fine. Um, and it's just very refreshing. And we take um, master's classes with urban agriculture practitioners in Singapore and really try to understand what the politics of urban agriculture in Singapore is like, what are the methods, what are the differences in their approach to what we've read from other people. The design of this course is actually not to turn students into ur urban agriculturists. It is really more of them understanding and realizing how difficult it is actually to, to grow your own food in the city. My hope is that you know, eventually our students will take on careers in the future um, and hopefully they will be making decisions that would um, actually you know, uh, be beneficial to the future of urban agriculture. It makes me a lot more sympathetic to like, different stakeholders. Um, I think I'm better able to like, understand exactly what goes on in the ground and like, what is necessary for farming to work. Do you really start to appreciate how hard farming is? Something you can get from the literature but you really have to experience it for yourself. 